Hello everybody, today we are going to play The Legend of Zelda Minish Cap. Uh, please like and subscribe, hit the bell if you want to hit the bell, you don't have to, helps for you though. Um, we are, today we are playing Zelda The Minish Cap, be, and we are playing this instead of Metroid Zero Mission, because tech, due to technical difficulties, so, um, yeah, this is, uh, it's, that series is currently postponed, but let's start this and name ourselves Link. Link. Come on. L-I-N. Okay. Okay, and we are doing this. Uh... And let's start! A long, long time ago, when the world was on the verge of being swallowed by shadow. The tiny Picori appeared from the sky, bringing the hero of men a sword and a golden light. With wisdom and courage, the hero drove out the darkness. When peace had been restored, the people enshrined that blade with care. So, uh, Zelda is entering our home. Good morning, Master Smith. Goodness me, Princess Zelda. Did you sneak out of the castle and come all this way alone? The minister's sure to be worried about you. You know how he gets. Oh, don't worry about him. He'll be fine. Where's Link? The whole town is bustling for the annual Pakori Festival. I thought he and I might go together. Would you mind terribly? Oh, is that what you're here for? Well, Link was up late helping me last night, and he's still asleep. But I do have an errand at the castle. Yes, that should be fine. Link, time to get up! Hopefully he actually wakes up. Link, time to get up! Wow, that woke me up. That, that's crazy. That, yeah. Hello. Hey, Link. Princess Zelda is here. She'd like to know if you'd join her at the festival. Yeah, Link, come on. Let's go check out the festival together. Master Smith already gave me permission to take you. Yes, after all, the festival only comes once a year. Go on, have fun. And while you're there, you can do me a favor. I just finished making this sword for the minister at Hyrule Castle. Yeah, I wonder who'll be using that. I'd like you to deliver it to him. That's... It's a typical sword fetch quest. Make sure you don't lose this extremely important delivery. This is the blade that will be presented to the winner of the competition. Don't lose it. And while the two of you may be childhood friends, remember, Zelda is the princess of Hyrule. You watch over her, don't let anything bad happen to her. Master Smith, quit worrying. We'll be perfectly safe. Come on, Link, let's go check out the festival. Yeah, okay, wait, I'm... I need to look in a chest. Stop going so fast. <gasps> I just robbed someone. Yeah. Yay. Link, over here. Well, can we jump? Yep. Link, hurry, let's go. Okay. Over here, come on. I'm coming. The town of Hyrule. Oh, this music is so good. Here we are, Link. 
really doesn't it look fun? Come on, let's look around. Link, there's a storyteller here. We should stop and listen to it. Oh, I wonder what's over there. Oh my goodness, Zelda. So, the Pecori are real. My father always told me they were. Yeah, they are. They're, they're real. Oh, look at that. Stop. Say, wasn't there going to be a sword fighting tournament at the castle? I wonder who won this year. Oh, wow, over here. Stop. We have a winner. Princess Zelda, you won the grand prize and I draw and wow! You get the choice of any of these wonderful prizes. What will it be? First we have this lovely heart-shaped stone. I want that. Next we have this magnificent gem. 20 rupees. And next there's this teeny tiny shield. So which one would you like? Let me guess, the jewel? Oh, but this heart stone is very cute too. I want the heart! Give me the heart! The shield is so adorable, I think I'll take it. What? Why? Why would you want that ugly thing? What about the heart stone? It's cute. Or, or this giant gem, it's pretty. Honestly, they're both much nicer than that nasty little shield thing. I agree, who needs a shield? Nope, I want the shield. Can I have it? What a strange princess you are. Well, okay, here's your teeny tiny shield. That heart container, we only get in dungeons! This person had to go through a dungeon to get that. Doesn't the shield suit you perfectly, Like, Are you calling me short? It is a little embarrassing, though. It's so tiny. Hopefully I get a better shield. Yep, just as I thought. You look great. Now, if anything happens, you can protect me with that shield. Oh, I almost forgot. We have to take Master Smith's sword to the castle. Let's go, Link. Okay. Let's roll because it's fast. Come on, Link. Let's hurry to the castle. Okay. Let me just switch the buttons. Yeah, I like that more. Time to learn! Ouch! That must be the business scrub I heard the soldiers talking about. They were saying a Deku, De De Deku scrub had been hassling all the passerby. Like, do something about it, otherwise we can't get to the castle. If only we had someone to defend us. Yeah, we do. Come on, shoot your thingy. Please forgive me, sir. I heard there was a festival and I came to town hoping to hawk my wares. Unfortunately, we scrubs have a tendency to spit not so many speak. Everyone got scared and ran away, and no one would buy anything. This is a terrible place to do business. I'm going back to my cave. I actually feel a little sorry for that business scrub, but that not hurt. Oh well, he won't be hassling anyone now. We better hurry to the castle. And that is correct. This music is not as great as the other music, but it's not. Oh, Link, you brought the sword, did you? Then, as minister to the kingdom of Hyrule, I potho, potho. Accept this blade. You came just in time. The award ceremony will begin soon. I'm sorry, Link, but I better go. I have to prepare for the ceremony. Why do you have to be there? I had a good time at the festival. Thanks for coming with me. Since you're here, Link, why don't you join us for the award ceremony? Okay. This is exactly what we need for the plot. Do you know about that sword, Link? It's called the Picori Blade. Yes, we we heard about this in the intro. Yep. Ooh, the honor of touching the blade. If only I had won the contest. That would have been much, much better. Let the award ceremony commence. Vati, champion of the competition, you may approach the blade. This guy doesn't look very good. He just looks like an evil Link. Like, evil normal Link. 
<laughs> to think things would go this well. The Picori blade and the bound chest spoken of highly in lore. This chest must hold that which I seek. I'll relieve you of its contents now. Why are these guards so useless? <laughs> Do not interfere with me. Has Victor ever earned the right to approach the Picori blade? I've been waiting for this moment. Oh no. Oh no no no. He just broke the Picori blade thinger and let out the evils. Who are you? Why are you doing this? The princess with the mystic aura. The power that was gifted to the people of Hyrule still flows in the vase, veins of the ladies of its royal family. Interesting. If I leave you now, you only cause me trouble later. That will never do. To stone with you! And Zelda stone for the rest of the game. All who stand in my way shall share this fate. Now to find out what power awaits me in this chest. Empty? There's nothing in here but a rabble of monsters? What is the meaning of this? Well, I know the forest I'm after is somewhere out there. I'm in no hurry. I can take my time searching for it. <laughs> so, Vati, you're very evil. And you want to be evil and stuff. Oh, Link, you're awake. Are you feeling alright? Stand at my side, the King of Hyrule is about to speak. Okay. It is as you have all heard. A sorcerer named Vadi, yes. Okay. Vadi shouted the blade. What do I know about the Picori? Mm, I'm supposed to be very tiny. Don't want to turn the fairy tales. They certainly exist. The Picori is are in vanished woods, they should be able to repair the broken blade and reforge the sword. What? Then we must dispatch the soldiers at once. No, soldiers will not do. The Picor do not show themselves to anyone but children. Our soldiers can search for days and still find no sign of them. I see. If that's the case, then why not send Link? If Link has recovered, then yes, I would like to ask this of him. Recovered from what? Please turn my precious Zelda back to normal. Cory should know how to create a new sacred sword. It will be a dangerous journey now that those monsters have been freed. Yeah. Yes. Please take the sword with you, along with the broken Picori blade. You accepted the broken Picori blade! This is part of the sword needed to reforge the sacred sword. Don't lose it. I got a sword. Send for the soldiers to search for Vati. Okay, Deepwood Shrine. Yep. Okay, start the search there. Take this map with you. If you get lost, check the map. Okay, I'll be careful. And we, okay, we want to go there. I'm counting on you, Link. Only you can break Vati's curse. Oh, yes, we have a sword and a shield. Nothing can stop us when we have a sword and a shield. Okay, we are out of that place, and now we're gonna go to where we had to go. Ow! Give me a heart. Body really let out a lot of monsters. One rupee. Don't spend it all in one place. Well, I don't know if that's actually possible. Not to spend it all in one place. Also, I'd like to spend it in one place. Oh, What's this? Ah, nothing good. How do I get back up there? Well, I can't. That's, that's great to hear. Lon Lon Ranch. Okay. Uh, continue. Continue telling me. What's the deal? 
Eastern Hills. Okay, okay. Uh, map. Okay, I'm almost there. Yeah. Bam! Oh no, that's my shield! Bam! Oh yeah, we're so good this game. Minish Woods. Oh, this music can get annoying. But I guess that's how it goes, so... Gotta deal with it. Link's voice can also be not that great, but okay, it, it's fine. Okay, let's... That we can't do. Uh, we know that from experience. Um, that we can't do either, so let's go across this bridge. I always get stuck in this area, but I might be fine this time. Let's see what's up. A slime. And no. Oh, wait. Oh, yes. I broke the game. Oh, no. Okay, what's down? Slimes. A stump. Well, that's good. Up here is nothing. You know, help, help me! Ow, just won't somebody stop them? Ow, ow, help, somebody! Can't anybody hear me? Okay, let's go back, let's go back, let's go back. We gotta save that dude, that hat. Where is he? He... where am I? Okay, I'm at the very bottom. I think he was up there, though. So let's go up. Yep, there he is. Hey, kid, you there! Ow! Hey, don't just stand there! Do something! Ow! What's wrong with you? Do you like watching me... oh. Is this considered a boss fight? It was. Oh, sorry about that background noise. I, yeah, okay. Well done, that was close. Not that I couldn't handle them myself. Yeah, right. Yeah, right. But that's beside the point. What in the world is a lone child doing so deep in the woods? Oh, I see. The Picora, you say, and Vati. Vadi's curse someone. What, the sacred blade? Is that so? I see, I see. You know, you and I have quite a lot in common. You see, I too am on a quest to break a curse of Vati's. And you say that reforging the sacred blade can break his curse, eh? Well, then you have found yourself a companion, my boy. My name is Ezlo. It's a pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Okay. Wait, what did I say? You walk too quickly, can't you go any slower? No. Boy, take a good look at me. Okay. Ah! If it isn't one thing, it's another. You are a troublesome boy. There, now you can't possibly leave me behind. My, it's quite comfortable up here. More comfortable than it looks, surely. And much easier on me. Hey, quit your squirming. Can't you sit still? See? There. Mm, yes, yes, that's it. Much better. Now, I suppose a boy like you still has much to learn about the world. If ever you need my insight, press select. I'll be happy to help. Ah, uh, such a hopeless child. What? What do you mean, hopeless? Well, now we got our nice little hat. And we got... Yeah, I'm, I'm bothering you. Okay. Hold on for a moment, my boy. We've stumbled across something important. The world of the Minish is very small. You're far too big to meet them now. Who are the Minish? Oh, yes, yeah, silly me. Allow me to explain. You hu humans call them Pakori, but they refer to themselves as the Minish. Strange how in the world of humans, only this forest has kept this name, that name. 
Anyhow, deep in the forest, they built a tiny village where many now live. But if we're to enter the village, we'll have to make you a tad smaller first. Look at that. At first glance, it appears to be a mere stump, yes? No, that stump is a portal used by people long ago to adjust their size. With my help, you can use it to shrink down to diminished size. Just stand on the stump and press R to shrink. To return to normal, stand next to the stump and press R. Get me up there, and we'll give it a try. Ooh. Well, that's cool. But, everyone, I'm afraid we're going to have to end the video here. I'm going to save. But, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this very first episode of Minish Cap. Zelda Minish Cap. Tell me if you would like to see more of these in the comments. And, uh, yeah, like and subscribe and have a good day. Uh, I will see you next time. Oh, no, wait, how do I get out of the menu? Wait, I'll see you next time. And now I will see you next time. Goodbye.